perfectly balanced, as all things should be. Greetings, fellow adventurers. This is Vin Chariot, and we're still in the process of moving and packing and cleaning and all that kind of stuff. So I apologize for the uploads being all over the place and being very sporadic. But I want to record some stuff for you today, and I swear to you I have changed my shirt since last time I filmed. I just happened to wearing the shirt again when I'm filming. It's the same one I was wearing last time, so it looks like I just haven't changed my shirt. But I swear I actually have. I just noticed that. Also, I spilled orange juice on my desk when I was eating breakfast here, like, literally 30 minutes ago, and it smells like oranges in my room right now. I don't know. Anyway, I'm rambling. All right, so today I thought what we would do is I'm going to play as Thanos. We haven't done this in a while. We used to do a ton of Thanos videos because it's, like, the coolest thing ever. I'm going to play as Thanos, and I'm going to see which dupes that I can spawn can survive the Infinity Gauntlet. Let's go with the Mecha Marks robot. We're going to spawn one of this. That is a lot bigger than I thought it was from the picture. But that's a perfect target for us to smack in the face with the Infinity Gauntlet. Now let's see, what should I smack it with though? Because the Infinity Gauntlet, which I have not used in forever, so I almost forget how to use it, has a lot of abilities. Now I remember there was something about summon meteorites. Come on, that's easy. That's the easy peasy stuff. So just summon a meteorite up. It literally just popped out of existence upon being hit by a meteorite. One win for Thanos. Thanos gets one win. Alright guys, I want you guys in the comments to tell me, do you think a single dupe will actually survive Thanos' Infinity Gauntlet? Probably not, because that one... Uh, do the meteorites despawn everything? Let's try this with another one. Let's try this with another one. Um, let's see. The Almighty Golden Toilet. Now this one might stand up. This one might survive. Oh, it's glowing. It's a glowing golden toilet. Well, what better to smack with meteorites? <gasps> it lives. Okay, I don't think the meteorites are actually hitting it. I think that's the problem here. No, nope. up oh, one hit it, it's gone. All right, so the meteorites literally aren't fair. The meteorites are despawning everything I spawn. So I don't think that even counts, right? Spider machine. Okay, let's see what this thing looks like. It is absolutely really huge. Okay. Meteorite storm! Perfectly balanced, as all things should be. Okay, that's actually really cool. The legs are falling. The legs are falling. No, not the legs. No. All right, that thing was pretty cool to blow up. It was huge, and it was gigantic, and it was scary. Uh, I don't, it looks, this looks like a bomb. This is probably isn't safe. All right, let's use something different on the Infinity Gauntlet. What about the Reality Stone? Oh my gosh, there's a ton of stuff in here. Illusion, Pocket Dimension. Illusion makes another one of me, right? Yeah, so this is my illusion. Man, look at me. Look at me looking good. Looks so good. Um, Water Walking is just for walking. Wait, why am I not walking on water? Oh, I gotta be on top of water first. Then you can walk on water, which is really cool. I love this gauntlet. Okay. Um, and if my body at large, can I enlarge the bomb before we destroy it? I can! Behold! The giant bomb! Oh gosh, like, 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 okay, it's fine. Okay, sweet. My illusion is gone, but that's, we don't need that. Um, toggle ignition. I could just light it on fire. Pocket dimension, destroy pocket dimension. Okay, so what am I gonna use to smack this thing? I could use a mind... Annihilation, Mind Beam, Phase. Uh, let's do Mind Beam. That sounds cool. All right, stand back and boom. That's it? That didn't seem... I was expecting so much more than that. I was expecting a big, big... Okay, a cannon. A cannon. Let's do this. That's not a- what is this? It's a pile of junk! Okay, um, let's try- we need more, we need more, we need something really awesome. Something really cool. Why is everything in Russian? Okay, I mean, hey, say what you will, that looks like a chair with some tires. I mean, that's exactly what this is. <laughs> 
Oh boy, that right there. Yeah, I think it's time we smack it with the gauntlet. Are you guys? Are you guys? Okay, let's just do this the old-fashioned way. Power stone punch. The tires are still here. All right, which ones do you guys think would be the coolest flying bathtub? Come on, you know what you guys want. You know. All right, let me touch the stone to it. Boop. Oh my gosh, it's just... <laughs> this is so cool. I forgot how cool this was. It's gone. It literally just despawned it. I can't even dis despawn it. My despawn key doesn't even work because it doesn't even exist in this reality anymore. That is so cool. What about vehicles? Let's do some vehicles. Or buildings. Buildings would be cool too. Um, let's see. Oh, there's a tank. Let's see if a tank can stand up to the might of Thanos. All right, let's hit him with a uh, powerball. Boom! <gasps> no way. No way. It it resisted a powerball. How's that possible? This thing should be dead. The powerball is pretty strong. Hang on. Mm. Oh, okay. It, I mean, it lit on fire. But it's still here. No. How is this? Wait a minute. The Powerball destroys everything, right? I, I, I don't know. Space Stone. Let's do... Uh, you, wasn't there something about a... Uh, you can launch? No, no. That's launching me. <laughs> Oh, for telekinesis. Wasn't there something about making a, a singularity? Here we go. Black hole. It can't survive a black hole. Well, okay, so the black hole did despawn it, but the powerball bounced off. That is the weirdest thing. So the tank can resist a powerball, but not a black hole. I mean, come on, nothing can resist a black hole, but still, that's. That is unexpected, to say the least. That was that is the strongest tank I have ever seen in this dupes. Okay. Let's let's try buildings. Buildings sound really cool to blow up. Lift elevator. More like lift destructionator, if you know what I mean. Alright, let's press this button. Do not press. Alright, so it does work. It's a functioning elevator. But will it be a functioning dead thing? Um okay, let's see. What should I use to destroy it? The time stone really doesn't I don't think it does anything for destruction really. Wait, is this as high as it's supposed to go? Is this... Is this working correctly? I guess. Okay. Sweet. I'm just gonna go down here and destroy you. Alright, so... Ooh, wait a minute. I got an idea. I got an idea. I got an idea. If I press... This. And then use the time stone. Will the time stone... Make the elevator go back up? Let's watch. It does. It actually does. <laughs> it actually does. That is so cool. Okay, I think I might have broken it though. I think I might have. Anyway, all right. Let's see. Power stone, mind stone, soul stone, reality stone. Um, let's see. What do we want to do to destroy this energy storm? What does that do again? Does it just burn things? Yeah, it just literally lights things on fire. Which is cool. I mean, that's cool, but it's not quite what I wanted. Let's do infinity stone. Uh, direct gravity. Okay, so I can move the elevator around with gravity, but the tower is stationary still. Um, uh, timeline erasure, universal law, defines the laws of reality, snap, infinity beam. Now, the infinity beam will probably destroy it. The elevator is re semi-resistant to the infinity beam. It, did, it took a little bit to destroy it. All right, so the tower is definitely burning. Let's see, mind stone, sleep, wake up. This I don't think this really affects objects. I'm pretty sure this is just more for, like, actual, like, humans. Um, now, the reality stone you think would be able to do, like, all, like wipe. Wipe the target's existence from reality. Yeah, I don't think... It doesn't work on objects. What? Never mind. I stand corrected. That was actually ridiculously cool looking. Hang on. So it does work. It actually does work. Hang on, we need, like, big buildings. We need, like, some really 
awesome buildings. Um, let's see, here's a whole house. Okay, there, there's a perfect good house. So if I wipe this house's existence, like this, will it fade? No? You're not fading from existence? Fade from existence? Please? Please fade from existence? Why does it not work on these? That's so weird. Does it have to be an object and not a building? But building's an object. I mean, it's the same. Wait, I did it on a building the first time. Okay, what about the jail? Boom. Jail. No jail. No jail. That's so weird. It worked the first time. It really did work the first time. Okay, so what if... What if I open the door, and then I close the door, and then Thanos has to try and escape from prison? Hang on, close the door. All right, so Thanos is locked in prison, and first he tries to get rid of the prison. Erase the object. It doesn't work. It worked the one time I did it, but it never, it doesn't work again. Wait, is it working? Okay, it works. What was I on? But what, Was I on something? I don't know, I must have done something wrong. Okay, so I'm gonna wipe the prison from existence. Boom! Ha, <laughs> that is so cool! I do love that, I do love that, that looks so cool. Okay, so I must have been doing something wrong. So I can wipe anything from existence. It doesn't wipe the whole thing, but it wipes like pieces. Right? Ha <laughs> ha, no floor! What if I take the things that are like supporting it out? What if I fade them away? Will it fall, or is it locked in place? I think it's locked in place. Do I have to unlock it? No? That just pulls pieces off. Okay, sweet. Um, let's try that house that I couldn't get to fade before. Let's do that. Fade from existence! Okay, wait, am I on the wrong thing again? Do I have to do this? No, it's working. Okay. Haha, fade from existence! All the fading! from existence. Once again, I think the houses are locked so they won't fall over. They won't like topple. So even if you take the legs out, they still just sit there. All right, I want to try one other thing I'm curious about is sending a dupe through a teleport, especially a big dupe. What happens, right? Like if you've got a teleport or got a, a dupe of this magnitude, which honestly is kind of, I want to direct gravity at it. Oh, that is so cool. Look at it. Look at it. That is so awesome. And there it goes. You will be destroyed. Okay, that is so cool. Be okay, before we do anything, I just want to touch the stone to it and see what happens. Oh, gosh. It literally just erased it. From that is so cool. Okay, let's spawn one more. Let's spawn one more. Okay, here we go. All right, so that is so cool. So let's see what happens when I put it through a teleport. So we're going to get the gauntlet. We're going to put it through a teleport. Uh, random wormhole. Does this work on this map? No, 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 Matt. Nav me. -ish. So I'm going to do a set of waypoints. So I'll put it right here. And then I will make a wormhole right there. No, I guess I got to be closer. Like there. Oh gosh. Oh, what is happening? Oh, it's in the ground. Wait, what? Okay, hang on. Hang on. I'm gonna make the 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 nav point higher up in the air. The waypoint. Okay, I'm gonna make a waypoint up in the air, like way up right here. Okay, now I'm gonna hit him with the. Okay, what am I under? There we go. Okay, now I'm going to hit him with the waypoint wormhole. All right, so it does teleport the whole thing. It doesn't just teleport a part of it. It will teleport the whole thing. So if I go boom, he yeah, it teleports the whole thing. You can't teleport pieces and parts of it, I don't think. <laughs> That's still really cool. That's still really cool. I do like that. Now, what happens if I teleport something that isn't connected? 
All right, what is, what is, is there something that's like not really connected together well? Like destructible tower fortress. Let's try this one. This will be our last thing. We're gonna try this. It's our last thing. All right, so let me get out my waypoint. Uh, waypoint. Uh -huh. Okay, here we go. So what if I just do this? Oh gosh. Wait, did it drop the pieces? Hang on. Oh! What is happening? What happened? What? What was that? It did drop the piece out of the out of the wormhole. Well, I'm in the wormhole. Okay, hang on. Whoa! 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 Okay, what about this thing? Okay, hang on. I want to see if I can see it falling. Oh gosh! Yeah, because the other wormhole does open up up there. Yeah, I can go through it. So it is. It is teleporting it, but it does it in like a very weird way. Point is, is that it does. It will take pieces and parts as long as the things aren't attached. All right, sweet. So, this video, I think we found out the Infinity Gauntlet pretty much wins every single time, unless it's a tank. For some reason, that one tank could stand up to the uh, to the, the Powerball things, which the Powerball things do destroy things. Before we end, before we end, I'm going to shoot one Powerball at this thing. Yeah, no, the Powerballs tear right through everything, like tissue paper. That's what I thought. I don't know why it wasn't working on that tank. But, if you guys enjoyed this video, this is a very old-fashioned video, but if you enjoyed it and you want to see more like this, let me know. And leave a like with a comment. We'll see you next time.